Diffraction is a phenomenon in which a wave bends itself so as to go through an obstacle with an order of magnitude similar to that of its wavelength. However, light waves are made up of elements and particles, which we call photons, which are objects whose trajectory Newtonian physics would allow us to predict, just as simply as I predict these balls motion. And yet, there's a catch. Centuries ago, Thomas Young carried out the original double slit experiment, proving these predictions incorrect for photons through two slits. Do note that at this point in time, photons hadn't been discovered yet, and this idea was later extrapolated and experimentally verified with particles of mass. The final positions of the particles, in contrast, while seemingly random at first, form an interference pattern in the detector, as you'd expect from a wave. To know a particle's trajectory, we'd have to know both its momentum and position. Unfortunately, at quantum scales, a precise measurement of one of these two increases the blurriness of the other, that is, its uncertainty. And so, despite our ignorance, physicists came up with a way for us to determine a particle's location and some other of its wave-behaving properties. They called it the wave function, still at the core of quantum mechanics today. And this is how you get the probability of finding a particle at a given position. However, what this mathematical method said about the world as we know it wasn't all that clear. It raised paradigm-changing questions, such as what is the true nature of things but physical? Are we all just waves of Probability? The Copenhagen interpretation, shared by two of the most relevant minds on what was then this new field of physics, Werner Heisenberg and Niels Bohr, stated that the nature of a particle's wave was purely probabilistic and that the path a particle would take would only be decided once it was detected, or, as they described it, the wave function collapsed. Soon after emerged what was, in Richard Feynman's words, the jewel of physics. Quantum field theory tells us that particles aren't actual objects, but rather waves with their own fields and areas of influence. Wave particle duality is not the most intuitive concept, as many others in physics are. It has, nevertheless, proven itself to be extremely fundamental, still opening many doors, and including them as well, expanding our understanding of the universe.